Get lots of food in your belly and you're gonna do awesome, right? Trying to get things done so that I can work on my cake orders and look what happened. My sink will not drain. If they have more than 10 errors, they have to run to that light pole out there. super healthy breakfast today. Today's my big test. Yeah, you have a big math benchmark. I think you slept good because your hair definitely shows. <laughs> hey. Do you sleep good on your new mattress? Mm -hmm. Awesome. Now you feel like you're well rested? <clears throat> Get lots of food in your belly and you're going to do awesome, right? Good luck, buddy. I have two toasts, but I already ate one. Yeah, two toasts. <laughs> You were hungry this morning. After I took the boys to school this morning, my day went downhill. I was cleaning the kitchen, trying to get things done so that I can work on my cake orders, and look what happens. My sink will not drain. I've tried using that wire, I've tried using a plunger, I've tried liquid plumber, so now I have an actual plumber coming tomorrow to fix it, but that's as soon as they can come out. This is between 10 and 2 tomorrow, which stresses me out so bad because I have a very tight schedule I have to stick to this week so I don't get too far behind and get overwhelmed. And guess what? I'm running behind schedule thanks to my sink. It's actually my fault because I put our leftover chicken down the garbage disposal last night. It was like shredded chicken, so I do it all the time and it goes down fine and it's actually not our garbage disposal that's messed up it's I guess the food is just stuck in the pipe somewhere because I'm able to turn the garbage disposal on and it's running clear and it drains the water on the left hand of the sink down but as soon as I turn it off it fills back up so at least it's not that it's just a blockage is all it is and I can't get it unblocked and of course Eric is at work today but I'm about to go pick up the boys and then Jacob has practice tonight but obviously I'm not gonna be cooking dinner because I don't need to dirty up any more dishes if I can't clean them so I guess we'll have to grab dinner on the way to practice but I did get one cake almost completely done so I'll go show it to you here is the one cake that's almost done this is the one that the dog is gonna go on and I got a baseball bat and a baseball and I just have to add some text right here and then I think I'm gonna add some grass around the base but I finished my minions last night. I think this is the only one that you did not see, which is Loki. I still have to paint all of their glasses or goggles or whatever, silver, as well as his hat. But that won't take me long. The hardest part is done. I'm not sure if you guys saw Captain America last night. I can't remember if, that, if I finished that before or after Eric came in here, but there's Captain America as well. Boys are home. <laughs> What are you doing, dude? Can you get the ball? No. Yeah. <laughs> you can get the ball. Zainer, how was your test? Yeah, it's windy out here. Hopefully this video is okay. Yeah, let's play that game. Let's go. No, 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 no. So, hey, Zainer, did the green shirt help your brain today? <laughs> he said that there's a study found that what if you wear green it helps you in math yeah and of course Daisy wants to play ow, ow. Yeah. that's not the way you get to play huh <laughs> drop the ride on your toe <laughs> what they can't hear anything it's windy it's just passing windy <laughs> your hair is sticking straight up from the static the boys just left to go to Jacob's practice and I'm about to head out to go that way as well. We took two separate cars because Jacob has a big math benchmark tomorrow just like Xander did today. So I only want him to stay at practice for an hour and then come home and get a good night's rest. But as I was about to leave, I noticed that Jacob's bat is still here. <laughs> so it's a good thing that I'm coming so I can bring his bat because he kind of needs that for practice. Mason, Mason, when you go out 
up there and get your miss, not your head to blow. Alright, ready, get there. Good throws. Good throws, good throws, come on. If y'all are waiting on that baseball, you're more likely to get an error. We've got to be aggressive and go and attack that ball before it hits that ground. Because once it hits that ground, you don't know where it's going to hop. You have to be aggressive and, cut and get it. Another thing is, guys, come off those bags. The only one who I saw in that last first round coming off every time was Mason. Every time he was jumping off the bag and he did not let nothing get by him. You have to stop that ball immediately. You cannot let it get past you. You are our last line of defense. What happens if that ball gets past you, Noah? Not really. Good, Good save, Carter. Carter. Good save, dude. Good job, Carter. Excellent. Good job. No errors, Joe. If they have more than 10 errors, they have to run to that light pole out there. And they're doing good. They haven't had any errors. Wait, what? Right now, they don't have any errors. But they're only like the third person in. Sanders gonna be a base runner. Fast, fast, fast! Don't let them get you out. Just stay there, Xander. Are you ready? Yes. Got a runner on first, running. Got it. Got it. Uh oh. <laughs> Man, were the bases loaded? No. No. Yes. No. Alright, they were loaded, I'm fine with that. Are they turning out loaded or whatever? Depends on how many outs. If there's two outs already, I want you to go to first in that play. He just wanted to get his brother out. Uh oh, he's very run fast. Good. Way to save the day, honey. Hey, teamwork, baby. So you put the Drano in earlier today, you tried to plunge, it didn't work. I came home and I plunged it some more. Went to baseball practice, came home, and boom, shakalaka. Working. Yes, That's now fine. you can go ahead and cancel that plumber service. Wash dishes. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. You, you can wash dishes too. You win, honey. Winning. Yeah. Well, I've been washing like my mixing bowl and stuff. I've been washing it in the bathroom. That's it funny. looks really funny. It does look funny in there. In a little tiny sink. I know. Doing it was dishes. It's hard to do. But yeah. I had to do it because I'm trying not to fall behind. So. No. Yay! So happy to see a sink with a plunger in it. Yes! That looks like a swirl cake to me. And holy moly, that's a that's a lot of stuff in there. Really? Holy shnikes. How much cake are you making tonight, sweetie? I need like a professional oven, honey, that's bigger. Um, have you guys seen this kitchen? This is a small kitchen. Where is a professional oven going to go? Let's buy me a new house. Let me more counter space too. Hold the phone. <laughs> no. You like this house besides the busy well, street. I, you know, I like it. I didn't know I was going to become a cake decorator when we bought it. Yeah. We would have just ended up looking for kitchens probably if that was yeah. a fact. Because <laughs> we don't spend much time on our bedroom. We would have looked for a bigger bathroom maybe, like a bigger shower area and a big kitchen. That would have probably been the main goals we were looking for. Yes. If I knew I was a cake decorator, a business owner. <gasps> oh, I got an idea. If any of you guys are a home builder and want to donate a home to <laughs> us and build Amy the most magnificent kitchen in the world, then they should probably just donate it to us, huh? Sounds good to me. <laughs> hey, we'd even let them be on the vlog. Sounds good. Deal. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. Don't take me serious on that, but unless you really, really want to. But I'm just saying, we would we would have really dedicated more time to finding a bigger kitchen. I mean, this kitchen it's a fine kitchen. It's it's good for a family or whatever, but not for somebody that's going to be sitting in the kitchen a oh, ton of time every single week baking cakes and doing mom things like fixing lunches and dinners and still. Don't even leave a comment down below saying we go out to eat a lot. I understand that, but she does cook as well. I just like to relieve stress from her sometimes and not ask her to cook dinner all the time, so we go out to dinner. 
It makes it so much easier on you when you already Especially have to do cakes all the time. I'm busy with cakes mm. and when my sink isn't working. Yeah, yeah. Well, was, it's working right now. I was going to cook dinner tonight. That was the plan. Yeah. But hey, I didn't want to drop and we minutes. have baseball all the time too, so we're out of the house and on the go a lot. Yes. Yeah. So that's gonna be it for today, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the vlog. You know what? I haven't done this in a while, so I want to do it. Make sure you leave a thumbs up, a comment down below, let me know what your favorite part of the vlog was. And also, if you're new to the channel, you should probably hit the subscribe button because we're a pretty fun family and there's all kinds of stuff that goes on here. We've been doing videos for <laughs> forever, I think. It's, it's well over 2,000 days now. If you go to erictv365.com, I wrote a blog about it a little while back of all the people that have actually had 2,000 days in a row. And it's a very short list. And we're on it. Yeah, we're on it. <laughs> See you guys tomorrow.